I'm joined by the next Chancellor, John McDonnell. Hi, Aaron. How are you doing? You good? Very good. Very you had lots of energy in there. I know you've had a long day, up since five. Great speech earlier on at conference. Where's this energy in you come from? Are you excited? Well, look, look I get inspired by all the, well, the different meetings I go to, the people I'm talking to all the time. The levels of enthusiasm I've not seen for a generation since I was a young person coming into the Labour and Trade Union movement. So it's that sort of inspiration I get. But I think also people are so creative at the moment. You know, I, ideas are bubbling up all the time. So we're breaking through some of the stasis, the paralysis that there was in the movement for quite a while. So that's, you know, the World Transform has made a major contribution to that. I know I want to thank you for that as well and all who've participated in it. But the creative way in which we're approaching political dialogue and discussion now is the uh, achieved the breakthrough that we've got. So what do we do next? Obviously we don't know when the next general election is. It could be six months, it could be five years. So for people watching this, what's your okay. message the to them? The most important thing is get involved. Get involved. Two things. One, get involved in the discussion of ideas and then get involved using your expertise to talk about how those ideas can be implemented to change our, change our community, change our nation, change our world. That's the first thing. The second thing is to recognise also we have to be an electoral force and the way we become an electoral force, to be frank, there's only one way for me now. Get people joining the Labour Party, then linking up with other, other members of the Labour Party, making sure then we go out and win the arguments. The old Labour Party tradition under, under well, under recent, the recent period, and I don't want to name people, but in the recent period, was, you know, we've got to get the vote out. Yeah, of course we've got to get the vote out, but we'll only get the vote out if we convince people it's worth coming out to vote. And the, so the key thing for me now is we've got to win the next election. The only way we'll win it is if we win hearts and minds to what we want to do in terms of change of the world. Then when we go into government, we all go into government. This isn't about electing Jeremy Corbyn or me or Labour MPs to do it for us. We all go into government and we become part of not the inspiration, of course, but also the implement, um, implementers of the policies we want to see. Very quickly, I know you're tired. What's the, the prize, briefly, for somebody watching? What's the prize on offer here if we uh, win big? Well, this is absolute transformation. This is, you know, I said in my speech today, uh, we campaigned on the basis of another world is possible. It's in sight. It's actually in sight. So all those dreams and ambitions that people have about how they want to improve the richness of our lives and our community is now in sight. We could do it. This could be the generation that breaks through. Hero. Thank you, man. Thanks a lot. Yeah, yeah.